All right, hello ladies and gentlemen, my fellow moos, hope you guys are doing good, hope you're healthy and safe. We are back with some more Yu-Gi-Oh! World Championship 2005, Seven Trials to Glory. And off screen, I pretty much remade my deck for the most part because, you know, the limitation tournament now forbids me from using dark attribute monsters. And let's face it, that's a majority of my deck because of effect monsters and the 1900 attack points monsters in general. So now my deck is like this along with you know some other cards that are forbidden aside from you know dark type monsters like Raigeki is still forbidden. Mage Power, United We Stand, Change of Heart, all of those forbidden. So now we have seven colored fish because now we have 1800 attack points monsters back in my deck because again most of the 1900 monsters that I have are dark types so yeah we got Hain Hain to replace one of the gravekeepers guard copies I also have one gale lizard as well um, and a Yomi ship to replace the uh, blast sphere um, we have Dynamis dark witch pretty much 1800 attack points monsters to sort of swap, you know. Harpy's brother. We got Goblin Attack Force. Three Spear Dragon copies to make this work. X Head Cannon. Great Angus. Ninken Dog. And three copies of Sea Serpent Warrior of Darkness and two copies of Blazing and Pachi. And that's all we can do pretty much. That's the strongest cards that we can use to replace what we have. So now we officially are ready. And we're doing all of this, and then if after this, we have to put everything back to the way it was again. Hilarious. <laughs> so let's do it. Let's go. We're about to begin the third round of the limited tournament. In the third round, using dark attribute monsters is forbidden. Now then, it's time to phase your opponent. Bakura, enter. And again, this feels like more of a limitation towards my opponents than anything else, because... Yeah. Since I can't use dark attribute monsters, I can't use my favorite monsters. Though they are kind of gross looking. See? He's limited. More than me. <laughs> so Bakura is probably gonna have a brand new deck because he can't use dark attribute monsters. So let's take a look. Dimensional Warrior. Doesn't this remove from play a monster that attacks it? Oh boy. Yeah, this is a tricky start. All I have is Magician of Faith and Cybertech Alligator. Can I bait? I could try. It'll be risky, but it, it might be worth it. Let's take a look at this trap card. Oh, if I bait this for Cybertech Alligator, I'm gonna have to use 7 tools of Venom. Okay, we're good. The bait is gonna work. I can get Cybertech Alligator on the field next turn. Gemini Elf. Alright, since Ring of Destruction is going to keep annoying me... I'm trying to remember here... Uh. It might, it might not remove from play one of my monsters, we'll see. Will he risk attacking? Yes he is. Alright. I'll worry about it next turn. Right now we're gonna do some damage. Hopefully I draw a monster card. <laughs> I 
<laughs> Excuse me. I hope this works. He might put the dimensional warrior in defense mode. I don't know. I feel like it's gonna remove from play the monster that attacked it. If that's the case. Hopefully I draw one. Dimensional Warrior doesn't have a lot of defense. Um, well... I'm baiting the trap card. Wish me luck. Oh hey, I have that card. Oh no! It's Penguin Soldier! Oh. Well, damn. Okay, so he didn't use the National Warrior, and now I'm back in square one. This is interesting. And that's another Gemini Elf. Alright, we have Enchanted Diablin, so it's fine. Next turn, Yomi's ship is gonna kill it. No harm done. Debate is gonna work out. Spear Dragon. Okay. I hope he attacks me with Gemini Elf. Because this card is very specific. The card that destroyed it is gonna get destroyed. Oh, fuck. Oh no, he attacked with a weaker card. Fuck me. Why? Son of a bitch. Okay, fine. It's fine. I'm gonna do something else. Yeah, this works. I hope this works. That must be Dimensional Warrior, so you know what? I'm gonna get rid of it before I get Cybertech Alligator on the field. Oh! Ouch! Banisher of the Light. He's not using that card, and that's throwing me for a loop. Oh god. That's fine. Uh oh. Sure, why not? Let's bait. Oh, he's healing. All right. I can't do this. I gotta wait for the bait. Because he's gonna attack immediately. I gotta play it safe. Okay! That's as safe as can be. There's no monsters. I don't know what happened to the National Warrior, but it's non-existent. Uh, can't risk it yet. I need a normal monster. Uh, I mean, I can use this to bait. Huh. Alright, bait successful. And now I have a setup for Cybertech Alligator. This is working out. Yeah, let me get this on. Oh, 
I'm gonna get rid of this card. And if this is Dimensional Warrior, good riddance. It's Galangle. Okay, he draws a card. Okay, now we're good. We're in a safe spot here. Alright, can I attack? Oh no! Fuck. I should have attacked with that first. That's fine. Next turn I should be victorious if he summons a monster with 1000 or more attack points. Hey, there it is! Alright, this worked. Unless that's the seven tools that abandoned. Okay, we're good. Oh. Oh. Uh. Can I attack? Ooh. This was interesting because I'm not using my regular deck, but it worked out. Yay! Victory is mine. Ah, I lost. Maybe I should study up more on the heart of the cards that Yugi keeps t mentioning. Yep. Congratulations, you've made it to next Saturday's fourth round. Your opponent will be my Valentine. Also, in the fourth round, using wind attribute monsters is forbidden. Poor my. I can work with this. 1,000 dual points for each victory in this tournament. Love it! Alright, let's do this as quickly as possible. Just check in here, card packs. Uh, no. Alright, now to edit. First things first, let's see if the cards are forbidden. Yep. Premature Burial is still Gucci, Ring of Destruction is not Gucci. Alright, all of this has got to go. All of this has got to- oh yeah, Wind Attribute Monsters. I can't use Luster Dragon or Spear Dragon. Fucking hell! It's fine. Ring of Destruction is also forbidden. Wait, I had two of them in my deck? I didn't even notice. Well, now they're both gone. Cybertech Alligator, gone. Alright, let's uh, put the cards back, shall we? Alright, gotta find Ryukoki. Put two goblin attack forces, why not? Uh, Dark Elf was in my deck. Force Raider. Archfiend Soldier. Mad Dog of Darkness. Mechanical Chaser. Alright, now 
we're gonna go to the effect monsters. Uh, let's just sort these based off of attribute. It'll be easier because most of them are dark type. Uh, still in this one. Light attributes. Here we go, dark. Where are my cards? Here we go, Blast Sphere. More Evolution. Eudoria, two copies of Gravekeeper's Guard. Did I have anybody else? remember here let me just keep going down because it's all based off of attribute I think that was all of them yeah all right spell and trap cards Raigeki is finally available let's go Alright, spell cards. Is Monster Reborn available? No, but Change of Heart is. Mystic Plasma Zone is back. United We Stand of Mage Power are not available. Uh, trap card wise, I think we're. I think we're Gucci. Alright! We did it! <laughs> I did this as fast as I could. Alright, my Valentine awaits, let's go. We're about to begin the fourth round of the limited tournament. In the fourth round, using wind attribute monsters is forbidden. Now then, it's time to face your opponent. My Valentine. Enter. No matter what the stipulations, they won't hinder my skills. Here I come. Let's go. What attributes will you use now? Probably female monsters, regardless of attribute. She has a brand new deck. Alright, compulsory evacuation advice, metaphotation, new Doria, meta of darkness, fisher, smash it up. Nice. We're gonna put these on the field because I hate card destruction and people have used it a lot, so no thank you. I wanna keep my spell and trap cards. Queen's double. Yep, female cards called it. She attacks my life points directly, I think. I don't remember. It's not that much, so why would I bother? It's literally 350 attack points. I don't give a shit. <laughs> problem. I'm gonna keep my monster. I'm gonna save it and use it next turn because I don't have a lot of monsters in my hand right now. So I gotta bring it back. I have a lot of safety here. We're gonna go small and simple. Let's go. This is gonna get more challenging as we keep going, so it's gonna be great. Ooh, don't mind if I do. Yeah. Let's 
Alright. My monster might die, we'll see. Spread of the harp. Well, it's a good thing I used Mystic Plasma Zone. But even then, I still have Fisher and Smashing Ground, so it would have been fine. Alright, this should be Gucci. We got this. My deck is awesome! Better off using this. Boost. Oh man. I was about to win this duel. Alright. <laughs> you managed to survive for one more turn. I was gonna win. <laughs> She's playing it safe. to attack with that one first, just in case. Alright, next turn she's done, but yes, I called it female-based deck. Kinda like Tayana in Forbidden Memories. Look at you with your Bistro Butcher! You are toast. We got it. So far, so good. Since you've beaten me, you better not lose to anyone. Not until I defeat you, that is. Congratulations, you've made it to the next Saturday's fifth round. Your opponent will be Joey Wheeler. Also, in the fifth round, using trap cards is forbidden. Oh my god, <laughs> it's gonna get steamy! Good luck and see you next week. Now we're talking. <laughs> uh, you know what I'm gonna do to replace trap cards? I'm gonna put more spell cards to where I won't even need trap cards to worry about. Oh man, a deck with no trap cards. This is going to be intense. Alright, let's make the deck edit right now. Raigeki is forbidden and I never once got to use it. Sad. Alright, let me put everything back. Uh, trap cards are forbidden, so let's get... Oh wait, hang on. One thing at a time. Gotta get rid of the limitations first. Premature burial as well? My god. Oh, I missed my trap cards already. Okay, first things first. Is this the week that we get our favorite card? Yay! 2D spells for this shit. Alright. 
Uh, snatch steel is available. Mage power. Yeah, I have an idea for what I can do with these trap cards being gone. Uh... Where's my Luster Dragon? Come on, where is it? Luster Dragon, hello! There we go! Gate attack is gone. Trap hole is gone. Seven tools of the bandit gone. No more enchanted javelin. Okay. I basically need six more spell cards that can replace some trap cards at least. Or make things easier for me, so let's see what I can do here. We got Dying Kato the Cure Master in case I need it, so that's one. We got Fisher, we got Moss Reborn. Nobody uses Let me check here. Yeah, no one no one I'm gonna fight right now is gonna have a face up trap card. Oh wait, I'm not gonna need these spell. I mean unless Joey has a field spell card and a or an equip spell card that's staying on the field. I won't be needing this. Uh, block attack. We use this as a maybe. Rush recklessly. Uh, what does this do? Nope, Dark Magician stuff. Offerings to the Doom is something I can use. Destroy one face up monster, skip your next draw face. I don't care. I think I also have Tribute to the Doomed. Tribute to the Doom. Um, okay, I can put a couple more effect monsters that have a certain uh, ability. Um, I could put a second Blast Sphere and make it count as a trap card. And a second Magician of Faith, maybe. Yeah, I actually wouldn't mind putting a second Blast Sphere. I could put another Hain Hain, right? Another Hain Hain. Another Blast Sphere for backups. And a Reflect Bounder, just to keep things interesting. That's about all we need. Like, we don't need a lot. I can use Nimble Momonga as my enchanted javelin backup, right? Yeah. Backup situation. We got this. We're gonna use that. Let's do it. I am ready to face Joey. With no trap cards. Let's go. We're about to begin the fifth round of a limited tournament. 
In the fifth round, using trap cards is forbidden. Now then, it's time to face your opponent. Joey Wheeler, enter. <sighs> Alright, I'm fired up. You won't like me when I'm fired up. <laughs> Interesting. Damn it, he starts first. Fuck. The one good thing... Oh wait, I start first. The one good thing about no trap cards, I don't have to worry about my monsters getting destroyed, therefore I don't have to bait, and what the fuck am I looking at? My monsters can still get destroyed with Fisher, Dark Hole, and all that other shit. But what the fuck am I looking at? Oh my god. Okay, block attack, snatch steal. Oh god, this is, this is, this is a lot of things. This is a nice setup for mage power though, not gonna lie. Let's do it, I'm committed. <laughs> Watch, my monster's gonna die. It's okay. I was not expecting my hand to start like this. This is a good backup bait. Blast Fear is gonna be there for backup. I hope my monster doesn't get killed. Cave Dragon. Nope, it's just a tanky defense. Okay. Lesser Dragon number two! Nice! It's gonna fall for the bait. It's gonna get destroyed at this point anyway, right? Let me just attack it. Because otherwise I'm just wasting time. Also, I think I cancelled out my Blast Sphere because I have a full field trap uh, situation. Oh! Axe of Despair! He had the same idea as me. Unfortunately, I don't have any spell cards to bring back. Alright. This was perfect. This could not have gone any better. Game over. <laughs> this was nice. A very nice round. Awesome. See, I didn't do too much. I just added a couple of extra monsters and backups and yeah. Now we're gonna redecorate our deck again <laughs> for the next round. Man, I must be the unluckiest guy alive. I couldn't draw the right card to save my life. You poor thing. Congratulations, you've made it to the next Saturday's sixth round. Your opponent will be Yugi Moto. Also, in the sixth round, using effect monsters is forbidden. Ouch! No effect monsters. But I don't have to deal with effect monsters either, so yay! So, you know what that means. Trap cards are coming back, baby. I can pull off getting Yugi. Effect monsters are forbidden, I might as well get rid of them now. I do have quite a bit. Each power is still available. Oh, I do miss my effect monsters. I miss my babies. Alright, let's finish taking a look at what spell cards are available. Change of heart. I 
You know what? I will use fucking Heavy Storm for this one, because Yugi can have a bunch of trap cards when I don't have anything else on the field. Moss Reborn and Premature Burial, and United We Stand and Mage Power. Let's fucking go. Alright, I will not need Malevolent Nuzzler in this situation. Is that everything? Yeah. Alright, let's put the trap cards back. Mega Destruction is available. Make sure I didn't miss any of my other cards. Nineteen hundred attack points. I just need three more monsters. There. Because, you know, the effect monsters take up the rest of the space. Alrighty! Let's do this! <laughs> Let's fucking do this! We're about to begin the sixth round of the limited tournament. In a sixth round, using effect monster cards is forbidden. Now then, it's time to face your opponent. Yugimoto, enter! The tougher the rules, the more a duelist needs to depend on skill rather than luck. You said it best. Let's do this. That's why the limited tournament is awesome. The longer you go through it, you know... Ooh, mage power, let's go. Mage Power of Horse Raider, let's go! Alright, first thing I'm gonna do though, I'm gonna wait. I'm not gonna use the Mage Power just yet. Ow! This hurts my soul. Oh, that hurts my soul too, but it's okay. It hurts us both. Okay! He destroyed my my trap cards. How nice. Well, that cannot be an effect monster, so Oh wait. Ah uh... Smart. Fucking hell. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, he has no cards in his hand. He discarded a trap card. Alright. A lot of things are out of the way now. Now, the other thing is, sometimes during the limited tournament, the final three opponents may not always follow the rules. So you never know. Well, this fucking sucks. I can't destroy that damn card now. This is my, you know, my boost. I need an equip spell card. He's gonna stall me. <laughs> damn.
Ah, this works. Fuck you. I think when this duel is over, we're gonna have to leave the limited tournament for the next time. Or, depending on how fast I beat him, I can pull off going against Kaiba immediately and cover all of this in this episode. It's a lot of rounds. I think the limitation for Kaiba is F uh, spell cards, which is fine, trap cards are better. pull it off because all I gotta do is get rid of the spell cards and then put a couple of monsters maybe to help me out and that's about it no equip cards so I'm gonna get some stronger monsters in oh wait I already was yeah no nice at 42 minutes. Oh god, this will be a long one if I do this. Do I save this final duel for the next episode and then immediately start with the championship? I think I should. It's gonna be too long of an episode. It would be best. But at least I'll edit the deck right now. Alright, what is forbidden exactly against Kaiba? Spell, yep, spell cards are forbidden. Spell cards. <laughs> nice, Ring of Destruction is available. I just remembered something. I forgot to put back my effect monsters in my deck. Oh, this is hilarious. Uh, let's put them back. maybe oh wait I'm not gonna need magician of faith so yeah maybe mask of darkness would work two blast spheres Still use Nibble Momonga in case of an emergency, maybe.
Yeah, I can put a third copy of that, why not? They're pretty much gonna replace, you know, some spell cards, so might as well get some strong cards out there. Have a interesting balance, right? Alright, that's about all we can do. Ugh. This is the final round, and I did come this far. I might as well extend the episode for a few more minutes and just do it. Let's hope I can beat him. After seven weeks, we will finally crown the winner of the tournament today. We're about to begin the finals of the limited tournament. And the finals, using spell cards is forbidden. Both duelists enter. Hi, we meet again. You're nothing but a breeze compared to my hurricane. Prepare to be blown away for eternity. <laughs> Look at these lines that he has. You're nothing but a breeze compared to my hurricane. <laughs> oh my god, who comes up with these lines? I love it. Alright. So everyone's going to be using trap cards. And he has Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon ready and waiting. The scariest part about Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon is I don't have Fisher or Smashing Ground, but I do have trap cards that could destroy it. Problem is, I only have one right now. So, you know. There's that. So if he summons Cyberstein, I'm gonna be in trouble. I'm in trouble. This is horrible. I'm in trouble. <laughs> I wish Fusion Summon counted as a trap hole target. This is horrible. Oh my god. I think this game is over. Uh... Yeah... So if I do this, yeah, I, I, I am officially gonna lose. There's no way I can- I can't do anything about this. It's the blue eyes combo, you can't do anything about it. And then he has that. Yeah. I'm gonna have to officially, for the first time, restart my game. <laughs> the fucking blue eyes, I can't do anything with this hand. I haven't- this this will officially be the first time I'm losing, but yeah. I mean, I don't know. If I get- the only thing that can save me right now is compulsory evacuation device, or any of my effect monsters that returns cards to his hand. That's the only way- oh wait, no, I've lost. I have lost. It's fine. <laughs> We're gonna restart. Cause yeah. Uh, I will count it as a loss, though. Yeah, you, I, I, my hand like that, I cannot destroy that blue eyes ultimate dragon. It's just not gonna happen. And I, I even added extra monsters that you know get his cards back to his hand. That's the thing with that combo. That combo is very, very. You know, I just have to draw any one of these cards and I'm good. Or Ring of Destruction, right? I have all the cards I need. I just have to draw one of them at the start of the duel and I'm good. But yeah, this is the regular restart so I can't actually do this. I'll count it as a loss though. But yeah, that's bullshit. <laughs> That blue eyes combo is so mean if you don't start with anything good. The only way you can win that combo is if you just don't go against that. Like, look at this. This is how I needed to start last duel. This is perfect. Perfect. This is exactly what I needed. Compulsory evacuation device. His strategy is fucked. That's all I needed. 
I had the cards, just didn't draw it. So if he does it again, it's gonna go bye bye. He didn't, of course not. Oh my fucking god, are you serious? <laughs> Uh, this is gonna be a long duel. I have one seven tools of the bandit. Okay, I'm gonna do the first bait because he officially has one card in his hand and that's about it. The first bait is I'm gonna just attack and bait the mirror force or whatever, right? We're gonna do that first. Negate attack. Okay, that's that's lovely. Unfortunately, I can't get anything else in the field when this happens. I don't know why the game does this, but yeah. That's fine. Oh boy. If he has torrential tribute, it'll benefit me greatly. Alright, we're gonna use the other giant oak as bait. Okay, it's safe to summon monsters. Alright, I might and I might not activate my trap card to cancel whatever he does next. Let's take a look. Negate attack again. You know what? I'll leave that. As long as my monster doesn't die, I'm fine with it. It's okay. So that's two negate attacks gone. Alright. So far so good. We gotta bait all this shit out. It's like dueling Odeon, you know, a bunch of fucking trap cards. Deadly. No problem. We have trap hole. That's the first blue eyes dead, and he cannot use Monster Reborn, but he does have Call of the Haunted. So, with Call of the Haunted, he can bring it back. Unless we have a nice plan here. Alright. It's safe to summon monsters. So now... Uh, we're gonna do a lot of damage here, if I get to attack. I might actually do it, because I want to attack. I hope it's not Mirror Force. It's Widespread Ruin. Um, you know what? Sure. If it means getting rid of one, fine. Do you have another one? Okay, this was safe. I'm keeping seven tools of the bandit. Because now he only has one card in his hand, and he's gonna keep just drawing one card. So now we're good. We got this. So now he's gonna try attacking my giant oak, which is fine. We're good. This was this is scary without spell cards. Not gonna fucking lie. But it's doable. I think I'm just gonna do this. I could also just have brought Giant Oak back to my hand so I could summon it now and use it, but... This is better. I'll just keep it as bait. Next turn, we win. I need more trap cards, so hopefully this tournament gives me a nice deck that I can grab, or a nice pack. But yeah, I figured why not. I might as well finish the limited tournament in this episode. Gate attack, that way I can keep my giant oak in the field. But yeah, that strategy is 
insane. The, the Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon first turn, and I started with nothing but normal monsters in my hand? Yeah, that's not gonna work. <laughs> it's a matter of drawing your cards when you need to draw them. That was pretty cool though. Nice! We have won the limited tournament! So in the next episode we're gonna get started with the championship tournament. This was my best deck. Oh, it's the same thing. Congratulations! You've reached the pinnacle of the limited tournament! After overcoming all the rules and restrictions, I have no words but to dub you the deck master. I am the deck master! <laughs> I'll see you again in the next tournament. Yay! 7,000 dual points! Oh my god! Woohoo! I am the deck master! <laughs> Yay! Okay, first things first though. New card... Exodia Selection. Oh my. Blue Eyes White Dragon, Right Leg, okay, Summon Skull, Sangan, Dark Hole, Right Heki. This is a card I need. Swords of Revealing Light. Many Turbug. I will take these. Bistro Butcher, Witch of the Black Forest, Morphing Jar, another Penguin Soldier, fuck yes. Card Destruction, another Trap Hole, Pot of Greed, Wall of Illusion, Mirror Force, yay! Mystic Tomato, Tarantial Tribute, Jar of Greed. Oh my god, I am buying this! 20,000 dual points? You bastard. But it's fine because I get the first copy of Mirror Force and I get a bunch of good cards and why am I still clicking this damn thing? This is what I need. 20 fucking K, baby! I am so happy right now! This is wonderful. <laughs> Alright, are these cards forbidden? So if I want, I can make an Exodia deck. Maybe later for fun. Summon Skull is now going to be my real cookie replacement. Sorcerer of Villain Light is available. Fuck yes. Manitur Bug. Let's fucking go. Pot of Greed is forbidden. Mirror Force forbidden. Thresher Tribute is available though. But I can use Jar of Greed. I might use Torrential Tribute for emergency situations, like if I run out of cards. But otherwise I might not use it. You know, I think I'm gonna keep two copies of Wall of Illusion to replace um, one of the other cards. Wait, I already have... No, I'm gonna get rid of Many Bug. I'm not gonna need it right now because I have New Doria. Um, let me finish checking that. This is gonna go away. I'm gonna have one Gravekeeper's Guard, or I can have two Wall of Illusions that basically do the exact same thing. And I have two Penguin Soldiers. So I think officially I can say goodbye to Gravekeeper's Guard. Because I have two, you know... I have two. Alright, let's put the spell cards back. I have Source Revealing Light. I am happy. Three copies of Fisher. Kinda like Smashing Ground, but yeah. Uh, 
None of these are available. Alright, now I do have to get rid of a couple of normal monsters. Where's my malevolent nuzzler? Here it is. Two Blast Spheres. Well, since I have... I mean, I could get rid of one Blast Sphere. For the many turd bug. Two Wall of Illusions. Dragon, maybe? Luster Dragon? I love Spear Dragon, but... Yeah, I can, I can keep it like this, it's fine. Alright, this was pretty cool. We pretty much finished the limited tournament. So, um, I think I have to go two weeks again without registering for a tournament. And then the next tournament is going to be unlocked. But look at those trophies. Four of the seven trials have been completed. So now comes the championship tournament. So it's going to be great. But yeah, uh, this episode went a bit longer. Oh, one hour and two minutes. Oh god. <laughs> it's fine. We pretty much finished taking care of everything that we needed to take care of in this tournament. So the entirety of... The limitation tournament is now, you know, completed. I'm pretty much going to save here, excuse me. Yeah, so the limitation tournament is done. Let me take a look at my status, because I want to see the percentage. 45.7% of the game is completed. The 20k purchase was wonderful, so this counts as two losses, basically, and 59 victories. Fucking awesome. But yeah, these tournaments are wonderful, so if I need to raise my dual points, I can pretty much just, you know, do the usual. Um, but yeah, this was very fun. Very, very, very fun. I enjoyed myself a lot. The limited tournament is, it starts off funny, you know, you, you just joke around, it starts off funny, but then you gotta keep ad adapting your deck to the limitations and all that stuff, and it's fucking awesome. So that against Kaiba was definitely very terrifying because Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon. But we did it! So now, yeah, Championship Tournament is coming up next in the next episode. So I'll make sure to get everything ready and prepared so that we start that tournament up immediately in the next episode. So hope you enjoyed this extra long Yu-Gi-Oh! 7 Trials to Glory episode. But that way, you know, we could officially wrap up the limited tournament and, you know, take care of it. Seven rounds. This is by far the longest tournament so far compared to the Kaiba Corp Cup tournament. This was seven rounds. But the, on the plus side, it's not a match duel. If it was a match duel, oh my god, it would have been terrifying. Um, but yeah, I think the KC Cup tournament is still the longest tournament because it's a match duel and you go through seven rounds as well. So yeah, KC Cup tournament is definitely the, the longest one. But yeah, this was awesome. Hope you enjoyed it. Leave a like if you did. And if you're new to the channel and want to see more of this content aside from every other game that I play that's classic and, you know, games that I can run and a variety of games, feel free to subscribe and check out my playlist and see if there's a game that you would like to see. And I'll see you guys next time for the championship tournament. We fucking got Swords of Revealing Light. I'm so happy. The progress was real. Catch you next time. Bye-bye. Uh,